What is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. My name is always is Face Jasper and today, kind of a different video today guys, I wanted to talk about goal setting, motivation, I wanted to just rant off a little bit in this video. I'm not sure what I'm going to be talking about, or I'm not sure what I'm going to be uh, showing you guys in the background, probably some uh, work on footage from like today and yesterday and stuff like that. First and foremost, I want to say that the battle with Anthony is now, it should be live somewhere, so I will link it in the description so you guys can check it out if you uh, are interested in seeing it. Today I just wanted to rant off a little bit, I just wanted to talk to you guys, I just wanted to get you, you know, just let, like talk one on one with you guys uh, since it's been a long time since I did that and I always like to do it so. So yesterday I actually did a Q&A on the Gymshark Snapchat. That's pretty much the reason why I'm making this video. Uh, not because of the Snapchat Q&A but more of like the, the, the story behind it and, and um, how it all got together. So last week I got an email from the Gymshark guys. Hey, are you interested in doing a Snapchat Q&A on our Snapchat? I was like, yes. So I've been with Gymshark now for two years almost. And it's been an amazing time, but obviously um, with my socials, they're not super huge. So um, I'm not an athlete, I'm in the academy, which is like the, uh, you have like two stages, like the academy and then the, the, the main athletes. Obviously I'm trying to work towards being, becoming an athlete, um, but uh, for now I'm, I'm an affiliate or an academy member, which is fine, it's awesome. But I've never been featured on a Gymshark main platform like Instagram, Twitter or Snapchat. Uh, before this, so for me, t for them to ask me um, to do a Snapchat takeover was a huge deal to me since, I, as I said, I've never been on a main platform from Gymshark. So the last two years I've worked really, really hard and I tried to give my best for Gymshark and, and just in general for all the socials. And it's just dope to see something like that pay off like that. It's like them asking, it's, it's to some of you, it might be a very small deal that I did that. And it probably is a small deal in a couple years, but for now it's, for me, it's a big deal. And it's something that I've wa always wanted. I wanted to be featured on a G main Gymshark platform because I feel like it's, it gets my name more out there in the main audience and uh, not just in the gaming community, but also in the fitness community, which is uh, one of my goals that I've been setting. And um, so that's why I was super excited to do it. And pretty much this video is just gonna be me ranting about, it took me two years, guys. It took me two years to be featured on a platform like this. And you can say, damn, that's a long time, that's crazy. And with the other side, you can think also like, wow. So for two years, you worked very, very hard and you tried your best and it finally paid off. So after two years of hard work and trying my best and giving it my all and Make, hoping that one day it will come and knowing that one day it will come, um, it paid off and it always will pay off. But the thing nowadays with people, in my opinion, is that people don't really realize this. But stuff like this, whatever the goal is, and I always recommend you guys aim high. I mean, why, why aim low, you know? Why, why, wouldn't, you, why wouldn't you aim all the way up there um, and have like small little goals in between. But I mean, this is definitely one of the small goals, obviously, not the, the end goal. The end goal would be to be in a Gymshark athlete and a, like a main guy, but that's not the point. But always aim for a lot. Always aim for a lot. If you shoot for the moon, this is, this is, a, this is a dope saying. If you shoot for the moon, even if you don't get to the moon, you're still in between the stars. You're still up there, you know? You're still, you might not be up 100%, you, you might be at 90, but that's still high, you know? So why aim for 30 when you can aim for 100? That's what I'm saying. So a lot of people lack this patience. A lot of people just, after a couple months, ah, oh, it's not working, I don't see growth. I say to those people, focus, keep your head up, do what you do, and, and it fucking will work. Sorry for my profanity, but I'm just, I get so hyped about this. It's like, it's so, it's such a simple concept. Just know what your goals are, shoot fucking high, go for it, work your ass off and it will pay off in the end, no matter how long it takes. It took me two years to get on a main platform. I haven't, I haven't even been, not only for me with Gymshark, but also with FaZe. Like, I've been featured on FaZe Instagram a couple of times and in some videos, but I obviously want to want more. I want to work for more. I want to work for my own video on FaZe Clan, you know? So, for me, 
it's all about patience. It's all about aiming high and going, going for it. You know, I get so, you know, I get so into this. I, I just don't, I just don't get people that that give up soon. That's what I'm saying. If you love some, if you do love something and you want to go for it, just, why don't you go for it? And um, that's pretty much what I just wanted to talk about, man. Motivation. This is also another thing. This is the question that I got a lot in this Q&A. By the way, it was a lot of fun to do. I hope you saw it. If you saw it, please let me know what you guys thought of it. I got a lot of good feedback. But um, there was such a big question that a lot of people asked. Like, a lot of people ask this in general. How do you stay motivated? Like, how do you stay motivated motivated for two years to keep grinding without, with, like, little result? <sighs> Motivation is something that I can talk about for forever. And here's a, here's a couple things. For me, with motivation, it is it's a simple concept. Motivation is stuff. It's it's an emotion. It's like being happy. You cannot choose to be happy. You have to feel happy. You cannot choose choose to be sad. You get sad from something. When you motivation is just like that. You you can't just grab motivation and then you're motivated. You have to be motivated from within. It comes from something, you know? Whatever that is, whatever it comes from, you get inspiration from someone else, you take that and you turn that within yourself into motivation to whatever, to reach your goal, whatever that may might be. But a lot of people seek for motivation as this glass of water, like this. I can drink this and I'm motivated, which is obviously not the case. So for me, motivation has never been a problem because I've had that mindset forever. I, I just can't motivate myself. It comes from within me. And I think that's looking for that is probably the hardest thing out there. It truly is. And I'm not saying I can motivate myself to do everything. If I don't believe in something, whatever that might be, it's hard for me to motivate, get motivated to do that because I don't believe in it. But with this thing, a lot of people ask like, hey, I want to lose weight. What keeps you motivated? I, I like motivation to do it. And then I always, I always say this, ask yourself this, is losing weight really, really what you want to do? Is losing weight really, really, if you really want to do it, then motivation should not be a problem. Motivation shouldn't even be a thing to think about because you are gonna be motivated because you really want to lose weight. You really wanna change. So motivation is something, as I said, it's not something you get. It's something that comes from within you. Okay, so if you wanna lose weight, right? You have to you have to accept the fact that it takes work. So maybe the, the mindset is wrong there where you think, hey, I can lose weight with some easy, simple way and then you expect me to say, oh, just do this and it works. Within two weeks, you lost all the weight. But obviously, it's not true. It doesn't work like that. It needs work. So that's probably why you don't get motivated as much. Because you expect it to be very simple and hard. And this is something that really frustrates me with people. You know, people expect things to be simple, expect things to be easy. And I, I just don't agree with it. I just I just can't fathom how, how people expect everything to be simple. And there's nothing in life... Nothing that you want to accomplish that is simple. Because if it's very simple, everyone would have it. So, um, yeah, man. It's just one of those things, man. I can rant about this for, for forever. But um, I just wanted to say thank you so much. Like, thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for making it even possible for me to reach that. To, to go on the Gymshark Snapchat. To take over it. To, like, get so many such feedback from a lot of people I look up to. It's so awesome to me. It's it's it means so much to me that I really want to thank you and be, because without you guys it would not be possible, you know. And um, I mean, I things like that give me that extra boost, man. That that stuff, this stuff gets me, man. Because I love making videos. I love making content. I truly do love helping people. And I feel like when get that grind. For me, like for the last two and a half years, pays off like this. Even if it's a small thing, it does mean a lot to me and it does help me drive forward because I know, I just know that those little goals that I set or huge goals will eventually happen, you know? So, yeah. Um, appreciate you guys watching. I truly do. Um, I hope this can help you in any way. 
change your mindset around and you know really find that motivation within you and um thank you thank you again um even for watching this video man if you yeah if you can take any any anything away from this then um i'm happy you know so uh thank you so much for watching this video truly hope you enjoyed it Please, if you can, leave a like on the video if you did like it. Or if you didn't like it, please let me know in the comments. Don't be that guy that dislikes videos. But um, likes and stuff really help me out because it gets me feedback, you know, or comments. It, it gets me feedback of, of if you guys like the video or not. So thank you again, and I hope you um, enjoy this. Peace out.